Welcome to the Tech Infos in. in this video, we will talk about Brave Browser and its installation process on Kali Linux 2020.2, which is the latest version till now. But the installation process will be similar in the every next update release. You can install the Brave Browser at anywhere at any time following the same steps shown in this video. But first, let's talk about why we should use Brave Browser. What are its features? that makes it very cool and unique from the other browsers like Chrome and Mozilla Firefox or Opera browser. Let's talk about its first feature which is default search engine. Yes, you, you can set many search engines as a default search engines but here I am gonna set that the go as a default one. It has its own advantages which makes it far better than Chrome's Google search engine. WGO is recommended to use as a daily browser when you don't want to reveal your location reveal to the other search engines like it happens in the case of Google. So it keeps you quite anonymous as compared to Google's search engine. So if you want anonymity, keep using WGO for now. Let's move ahead to the next feature which is Brave Reward. Brave Reward is a kind of loyalty points that you will get each time when you browse internet on your browser. You can set your contribution as per your own preferences. You generate Brave reward points by seeing Brave browser sponsored ads while browsing. You can also set your monthly estimated payments amount. Brave browser will add sites here after you start browsing internet based on your intention attentions measured by its bot. But first, you have to verify its uh, its uh, reward wallet where you can withdraw all your earnings. It is a lengthy process, so leave it for the next tutorial. Now move to the next feature, which is Touring Brave Browser. Yes, you can use. You don't need to use any VPN or third-party apps to hide your IP. You just need to go to Settings, New Private Window with Tor. And that's it. You can even check it by typing google.com. It will show it will show some other locations like Russia. In my case, it is showing as a current. Let's check in the google.com. You can check here in the bottom. It is showing Russia as a current location. But you have to guess where I am and comment your opinion in the comment box. Let's move ahead to the next feature which is Brave Ad Block. Go to Settings and Brave, Block, Brave Ad Block. Here you will get an option which, which is filter all the ad serving networks to make it disable while surfing, while surfing any website. Let's move ahead to the next feature which is Chrome Web Store. Yes, it just supports all the Chrome Web apps and extensions like themes. If you want to take advantages, you can use them by adding it to your browser. Now move ahead to the next feature which is it does it does supports dark mode. Yes, you have to just switch it from the light to the dark thing and here we go. So now move to the next feature which is you customize home screen. Yes, you can even customize your home screen of Brave Browser. You just have to click on customize option and it will show you the various options here you can you can disable the wallpaper of the background to the solid color you can even switch off the sponsored image even you can switch off the brave rewards you can see it happens now you can even switch off the balances from the home screen you can switch off the clock here you can see the clock is seen but after disabling it it will disappear so these are the customizations you can make. So now, the, the favorite feature of the Brave Browser, for me it is Tor. Tell your favorite feature in the comment box. Now we move to the installation process of Brave Browser. Before starting, check the description link. I have put a link as a detailed guide. You can check it for the better understanding so let's open the google chrome 
and move to the Bri Browsers website. So now what you need to do, just type Brave Browser in the Google Chrome and just type download Brave and it, it will redirect you to the Brave Browser's download page where you can find download Brave for Linux, just click on it. And now here you can see the installation process for the different Linux distribution. You can see the, the, the process for Ubuntu Mint, the process for Fujiura, Open OpenESUS and some other CentOS like distribution as I am on Linux 2020.2 which is Debian distribution so I will follow the first one. So what you need to do, you just need to follow the instructions shown in this screen so let's copy the first command and open the terminal here and paste it on the terminal screen as you can see on the and it will ask for the password just give it to them and type Y to confirm it and it will start processing the command which you can see on the screen so it's done now it's reading the database so wait for a while it takes few seconds more now it's time to follow the next command just copy it and paste it on the Linux terminal so it's show you okay it means it's done successfully now let's let's copy the last start command just paste it here and it's done without any error so it means it's done now let's copy the update command and paste it here on the linux terminal just hit enter you can see the brave browser has been added in the linux repository so it's done now let's follow the last one command which is apt install brave browser with sudo command just paste it on the linux screen and but i am typing it manually you can use copy paste also just type y to confirm it to download and install 72 mb of archives of brave browser so now it's done you can see it's done it's unpacking the brave browser and it will set up after this the brave browser will install successfully just wait for a while yeah it's done it's setting up the web browser, processing tiers. Now it's done. Let's open the web browser. Just search for the web browser in the application menu. Yes, you can see the web browser is here and we can use them. So guys, this is the full installation guide as well as the features reviews. So guys, I hope you have liked this tutorial. If you guys like this video, just click on the like button and share this video to your friends and comment if you are having any problem. So guys, please stay connected with us. Make sure you have subscribed my channel. See you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.